So as you can see with our first garden, it is absolutely thriving and it's no surprise that I keep having to update you guys on how big it's getting because it's it's out of control. <laughs> so today Sam and I have a day off. It is a beautiful sunny day behind me. So now it's definitely time to start that next garden, expand our skills, start growing some veggies. The little seeds that I planted the other day have already sprouted. It didn't take them long at all. I guess with the right conditions, anything can grow. All good? Yeah. Let's hopefully not lose it all. Bouncing our way home. <laughs> All right, I don't know where Diane's gone. I think she might be down the hill doing some bracken, so we're gonna make a start on the garden. Bad at all like look at this soil diane's done a good job already look at that that's what you want see how it crumbles like that you hold it together it comes together but then when you do that it falls apart that's like the perfect structure of soil that's what you want first i gotta nail in these stumps to stop this uh you know landscape from shifting i don't want this to keep falling down so usually you put the stakes on the outside to keep the garden in, but I'm gonna be doing the opposite with just this side. The rest of it will be the other way around. This is starting to look pretty good now, but this is still pretty high, so I'll just chop into here. All right, let's see how this goes. Much nicer. Beautiful. Let's put the steaks in, shall we? That's not going anywhere. Cool, so the first section of this is done now, which is awesome. It's kind of cascading downhill. And I gotta try and lift it up a bit. I might just pull the dirt into the middle, clear my boundaries, put them in place and just see where we're at. You know, we can always level the dirt later. Diane's done all the hard work, really. <laughs> okay. Sweet. This is like the perfect piece of wood. This piece of wood is thinner there than it is at the bottom. I'm not gonna have to work too hard for that. Sweet. So my circular saw can't make it all the way through the piece of wood because it's a bit too wide. We're just going to use muscle power for this last little bit of it. Not my muscles, they're spent. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. I think that's bad enough. Wait on then, you reckon? We love our dogs.
is a bit of hard work because I'm trying not to stand where I've already, you know, tilled. And this isn't the greatest tool for the job. So we've had a little bit of a deliberation and we're looking at all of this grass here. And like, this was all covered up, but it hasn't been covered up for quite long enough that we think that it's gonna stop the grass from growing through. So we've got all this cardboard here that's done its job multiple times over. It's pretty much rotten away now, like look at this. So what we'll probably do is put that down as a barrier underneath and then poke some holes in it, get it real wet, and then put our dirt on top of that. So whenever you're putting cardboard down like this, you just want to figure out which way the hill's running. So our hill is running that way. And you want to put the first pieces of cardboard at the top of the hill. That way when the water runs down the hill, it runs underneath the next section of cardboard. And that way you don't starve all the soil underneath your garden of water. Now the dirt. Stop. Yep. Chickens. <laughs> the ladies came to watch you. garden looks fantastic we've got our straw over there for protecting mother nature likes to be covered up right Di? yep um, but we've also got straw because we reckon our chooks are gonna get pretty close to wanting to lay soon so we better accommodate their needs hey None of this fermented stuff from last time that was impossible to rip apart. Yeah, this is nice and dry. I think we're going to be itchy uh, after this. What do you reckon, Di? Probably, yes. <laughs> So we had a pretty good day today out in the garden. That is done, it's looking fantastic. Woo. This garden is thriving, Diane's killing it. Did you just plant something in there? What did you plant? Uh, some off cuts from some spring onion because I'm making stir fry for dinner. So had some leftovers, planted them in the garden. Cool, threw them in. Threw them in. We're gonna go in and uh, have some dinner, put our hair down. <laughs> Good job. Go team. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>